Well, the Duck Dynasty cast is taking over Vegas for the premiere of their new musical called Duck Commander, which is based off of their hit show. But it seems like one member of the family was more excited to meet Ellen. Sadie Robertson spotted Ellen at generous dining at the same restaurant as her earlier in the week in Los Angeles. And she tweeted this adorable pic saying, sometimes you see Ellen at dinner and you have a fangirl moment. So what are you gonna do? It happens. I'm excited to see Ellen too. And Sadie has something else to be excited about. She recently walked the runway at New York Fashion Week, something she told us about during our recent interview with Sadie and her mom. Yeah, I got to walk with Sherry Hill because I have a prom dress on with her. So that was awesome. It was really cool. And that came about because of the episode where Sadie was, you know, trying to find a dress for homecoming. And so, um, you know, the little, a little bit of controversy there between, her, conflict between her and Willie about um, what dress she was going to wear. But I think that's one of those stories that is universal as well. You know, it is, sometimes it is hard to find a dress that's appropriate and age appropriate. And so after that episode, you know, we thought, okay, let's make some prom dresses that are right for for her sounds like a good idea to me not only can it be difficult to find an appropriate dress but it can be a tough task to find one that's actually affordable according to a new survey by visa the average overall spending for prom this year is 919 dollars geez so how can you cut costs that's a lot more than we we back in the day. Our personal finance expert, Rochelle Shaw, is here with more. I just remember we got like a little Jessica McClintock dress. The guy had a little corsage. We went to Marie Calendar's. It wasn't very fancy. Yeah, I don't, 900, I just, oh my gosh. I'm like, don't lot. go. That's the best way to save the 900, don't go. Yeah, I just say, come on over and we'll just like watch Game of Thrones. Right, <laughs> right. Well, uh, you know, I've surveyed all my girlfriends for the last two weeks when I knew I was doing this segment. And I asked them, okay, was your prom good? They were only one out of ten. Oh, I always loved it. Said them it was all. great. I like the dances. Really? Yeah, I was. I, know, I liked all that high school stuff. Okay, well, I, I. But we didn't spend nine hundred dollars. Okay. okay thank and nobody you. professionally did my hair thank or makeup. You. And so you've got right. some ways like the hair and makeup that you guys right. can cut down on costs and still have a great time. Absolutely. Well, one is start with a budget. Yeah. Every time is start with a budget. Second one is put some extra money away. You know, when you know that it's coming, so that you can plan. But I don't know many people who say, okay, at one month we can go ahead and spend a thousand dollars. No. You know, not the average parent can do that so you know I like to go to consignment stores yeah. find a great dress do some alterations make it perfect for you you know one and of my share friends, with your friends if someone wore one to another high school dance and you know you can wear one to this so yeah you know. yeah one of my great friends her daughter is a fabulous makeup artist and she's only like 18 so she does all the prom stuff for like $10 for each girl oh that's nice you know what a great thing Becky your daughter is amazing Katie and find <laughs> talented people in your life that can do your hair and makeup don't go to the professional salon no no yeah. or go to the free counter right yeah, that's right <laughs> I, I go to the counter all the and they'll do your makeup I, or you buy the lashes and they'll put them on and then you look great so that's, that's not it's idea. not a huge expense but the dinner's the, also expensive too you know here's what I love to do for the dinner is have folks come to your house and hire somebody to come in and cook for them so it's all about how you present it to your yeah. daughter and son and you don't say look we're gonna go to consignment store get you a raggedy old dress and then your daddy's gonna make the shrimp creole that we had <laughs> last night Okay, they're gonna go, no, mom, that's not what I want. But if you say, you know what? I found this amazing dress in the right color. We're gonna tailor it so it fits exactly you. Mm -hmm. And then I'm gonna hire a chef and they're gonna come in and lay it out for this palatial dinner for you. Won't that sound amazing? Your kid's gonna say yes. Yeah, absolutely. And it's gonna save you a whole lot of money. I it's love just it. the way you present it to the absolutely. kids so that they feel great. And you're about the dinner anyway. They're also nervous about the dance and all the excitement. They never eat. No, it's not a big deal. No. So, yeah, very good ideas. Thank yeah. you so much, Rochelle. I like that color, by the way. Monica, over to you. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, shrimp Creole sounds good to me. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, ladies. Hey, it is the restaurant with the fun name Cheeseburger, Cheeseburger. <laughs> and there are now two locations in Southern Nevada. And more is Marie.